Hey everyone, Mike here with Musio. Uh, I thought I'd take a moment to just do a quick overview video of what is Musio. What Musio is, uh, what is kind of an aspirational title, we call it the infinite instrument. And the idea is that it's one plugin that you'll have access to a growing catalog of inspiring instruments over time. Right now there's uh, over a thousand high quality multi-sampled instruments available in Musio and growing. So this is, uh, this is one of the instruments that everyone this is a cello with our friend Tina Guo. The most important feature of Musio is the search function where you can just type in Let's do, this is from, uh, this is a 12 horn ensemble. So if 12 French horns playing all together uh, in unison on the Sony scoring stage. All right. But one of the things that's, that's exciting and I like to talk about is the future roadmap. And we are planning on doing a ton of stuff. This is what we're bringing into Musio. In terms of content, we have a lot, a lot of stuff coming. And we've got the Cinestrings Pro finally coming and it will be in Musio. Uh, and we, the rest of the Cine Symphony line from Cine Samples, we sampled uh, the Grammy nominated British vocal ensemble Vochi's Eight, and they are gonna be uh, bringing their instrument to Musio. Uh, we actually flew to South Africa and sampled some, you know, authentic African percussion and choir. We've got soundscapes and you know, other electric pianos and all these essentials. Uh, and then we actually, we, we did fly to Iceland and we sampled with at the Sirland studio, beautiful scoring stage they have there and in Reykjavik, and we sampled uh, some uh, classic like Viking instruments uh, and also an Icelandic uh, choir up there. And we have Women in the North coming, which was also sampled in Iceland. Um, then we actually, we were in Ireland and Scotland. So we've got all the things you could want from, the, from those two places. Yes, bag, bagpipes are recorded. And then we got a bunch of, uh, these are synthesizers that we have as well. And this is what we have slated between now and the end of the summer. There's other things coming as well, uh, but we haven't, we're not gonna say anything yet. They're gonna be surprises, but I think you're gonna get a kick out of it. Now, in terms of like the features and the technical stuff in Musio, the important thing, cause we get a lot of feedback. This is, we're a small team, so we're listening. What do people want? And so we have new and improved effects that are coming. We're also going to be adding multiple microphone positions. A lot of the instruments that we record on scoring stages require close room surround. Uh, and, and some of the pros out there like to have that can kind of control. We're going to be adding uh, some new instrument parameters, you know, ADS R curves, things like that. And then, uh, um, also articulation switch key switching. This is something that's essential primarily for orchestral instruments. You want to switch between staccato, legato, sustain, you know, uh, different people have different ways of working. So we will be implementing that as well, um, very soon. And that'll be coming to Musio. So yeah, that's kind of, you know, that's what we have planned and, uh, it's very exciting. What is Musio for? Musio is a standalone app. It works for Mac. It works for Windows. It'll work for whatever DAW that you currently like to use. You know, Logic, Cubase, Ableton, FL Studio, Pro Tools. Uh, it all works with those plugins. So, I don't know, give it a shot. You can, if you just go to the website, you can just download the thing for free. You don't, you know, you don't need your credit card. Leave that thing at home um, and give it a shot. Let us know what you think and give us feedback. There's an in-app drop-down menu here in the app where you can just say submit feedback and you can yell at us. You can say anything you want. Uh, hopefully it's constructive, 
but we do listen to everything. We read everything and we categorize it and we kind of look at, well, what's a common thing that people are saying? And then we go ahead and we choose to choose or choose not to uh, implement something. So yeah, um, I could go on for a long time, but I thought I'd just get started here. This is a first video of many. I've got my whole setup here. Look, finally have an overhead camera. So uh, I'm looking forward to to writing and, uh, and, and showing off this cool new plugin that we're very, very excited about. It has come a long way. It's been a long road. We started this thing about six years ago, uh, and it was just a sketch on a napkin, right? And now it is uh, something that is uh, a useful piece of software. Uh, and our job is to get the word out. Like we really want as many people using this as possible. And so if you have friends uh, who you think might be interested, if you don't mind, please share this video or share the link to museo.com and uh, get the word out. Help us get the word out. All right, that's it. That's all I got. Bye. See you later.